Hello Mzansi and welcome to Art Mzansi. More than five months have passed since the arrest of Zandile Mafe, the alleged arsonist of the South African Parliament. On the 2nd of January, police in South Africa detained Zandile on suspicion that he had set the fire to the National Assembly. Following a massive arson attack that destroyed the National Assembly, this development occurred. He was arrested on suspicion that he had started the fire after police arrived to find him sound asleep. Zandile had been sleeping on the street for some time. His subsequent court appearance had been imminent. Dalimudi, his attorney, requested bail on his behalf but it was denied because of the rumors that he is a terrorist and a possible flight risk. Recently he was back in court and this time he made a shocking revelation that made everyone question his sanity. He claimed that Blaine Zimande, the minister of police and Cyril Ramaphosa were keeping the remains of children born with albinism in their homes. He continues saying that the president is providing money for rhino poachers and that the minister of transport Figile Mbalula used money from the road accident fund to buy ANC t-shirts. In the aftermath of this revelation many were taken aback. Some even went as far to suggest that he was going crazy after he made some serious accusations. Zandile may not be who we think he is. Whenever he has been brought before the court since his arrest, he has made shocking revelations. The things he says don't just add up, so people assume he has some sort of cognitive impairment. Many people are curious about Zandile. It may be possible that Zandile is telling the truth about these allegations against the president and his cabinet, or maybe he's just going crazy.